In today's video, I'm going to be breaking down how you can beat cover two Mabel coverage for a one play touchdown in Madden NFL 21. What's up, guys? My name is Cody, and I want to thank you for taking the time to watch my YouTube channel today. My channel is devoted to giving you Madden 21 tips and tricks videos that you can apply to your own game, different routes, different concepts. Focus more on the route combinations than necessarily the scheme or the playbook or whatever. But um, if you're interested in that, if you're interested in getting better at the game, I've got blitzes as well, run defenses, all of that stuff. Um, but if you're interested in getting better at this game, I'd highly encourage you to click the subscribe button at the bottom right hand corner of your screen because we release four videos every single day. One at 2 o'clock Eastern, one at 4 o'clock Eastern, one at 8 o'clock or 6 o'clock Eastern, one at 8 o'clock Eastern. And then we stream every night at 10 o'clock Eastern right here on this YouTube channel. So a lot of content, a lot of material for you to digest and a lot of ways for you to improve. All right. So I'm going to go over this play from Gun Trips tight end. I really, really like this play, um, especially what it can do for you uh, against the cover two zone coverage. And we are going to show this to you. Um, we're going to run the play verticals. Now, all we're going to do on defense is we are going to come out in the dollar three, two, six cover two press. Uh, we're going to throw that Mabel coverage out there. Everyone loves Mabel coverage this year, so we're just going to drop that linebacker on the right side into a purple zone. So you've got basically a flat, and you have a purple zone. The purple zone is shaded at 20 yards, uh, which means he's going to get back for the deep crossing routes that you can run from this formation. All we're going to do from verticals is we're just going to put the tight end on a streak, put the running back on a little shoot flat. We're going to motion that uh, left of screen, um, that left of screen, and I sorry, I motioned the wrong guy. I meant to motion the left of screen inside slot receiver. Um, and we'll show you that really quickly here. So I'm going to motion this guy right here, Scotty Miller, over to the right side of the field. Uh, and then I'll set that route up right here just like this. And this little route, as you can see, is angled to the right. What that's going to mean is as soon as he gets past that little cloud flat, he's going to be going for a one-play touchdown um, against this defense. This is a very, very solid route combination, in my opinion, because mm – -hmm of how well that route really does beat cover two. And when you're running trips tight end, you will get a lot, a lot, a lot of cover two defense on one side of the field, especially on that side of the, the running back and the, the tight end. I find that a lot of people will be running a lot of cover two against me when I use this formation. And so that's why this cover two beater right here, it's just simple. It looks very much so like other plays that you're running from trips tight end. So people aren't gonna know that you're running this unless you're just spamming it over and over again. But this thing destroys cover two. So I wanted to share this with you. This is how to beat cover two for a one play touchdown in Madden 21. Now let's say they do something like this. Let me just show you. Let me say, let's say they, they run a cover three sky um, type of type of route combination, or I'm sorry, coverage combination here on this outside. And what you're going to see is you can actually, you can kind of fit this seam into the tight end, but this is, we're going to go into a beater from this as well for, for cover three uh, in just a minute. But really what this allows you is you have kind of a basic high-low. So if you take that left backside guy, throw him on a drag, let's say you guess wrong and they're, they're not in cover two, which right here they are in cover two. But let's say you guess wrong and they're in cover three, right? But they're in cover three deep half, right? Because most people will be deep halfing their cover three. Guarantee you, most people in Madden right now are deep halfing their cover three because they don't want to get beat over the top. They just don't. Um, if you, you see how he's angled to the outside, cover three deep half late is going to come to the inside. So if I pass this hard to the right, you see he's still going to beat that cover three zone. So that's a huge, uh, huge little add-in added bonus to this play it's going to beat cover three it's going to beat cover two as long as they deep half now um, let's say they outside third in a cover three um or in a, maybe a cover four type of look then what you're going to see here and you this the window is still kind of there he's going to drift you'll see this uh guy's going to drift to the inside you can basically pass lead down um essentially hit godwin you know essentially you know if you get something like that check the seam seam route to the tight end that streak route is really um you know, it's really, really good. But basically, you know, you do something like this. And now what's going to happen here is you can check down to your drag. You can also hit this route to Chris Godwin. I'm hitting it way, way late in the play because um, I'm checking checking that right, right uh, side route combination for something else. But let me just show you really quickly. So, like, again, if they go cover three, which, again, this is designed to be a cover two beater. So you really want to be educated guess that they're in cover two. But if they catch wrong, they're in cover three right here. You can hit that right in that little pocket right there, as you can see, against cover three. Now, uh, in a little bit, we'll show you a way that you can t completely torch cover three um, 
from this from this formation from the same very play uh, we'll show you that here in just a second but make sure you subscribe to the channel if you haven't already um, and if you haven't joined the text message membership like I said it's completely free to do that we have free tips and tricks coming out in that every single week this last text message uh, membership uh, cycle we released a free gun bunch ebook basically um, over an hour of material breakdowns which is actually longer than a lot of people's guides are um, explaining everything you need to know about gun bunch we get it for completely for free to people who have texted in so if you haven't texted me i would highly encourage you to do that it is my personal cell phone number so no gimmicks no nothing with that either you can ask me any question you want related to madden uh, my number is 812-216-3644 also, if you want to connect with my community Discord, I'd highly encourage you to do that. It's a great place to be able to um, just talk with people who have played Madden at a high level and maybe you want to get some lab partners. One of the best ways to improve in Madden, in my opinion, is to have people to practice with. So Discord is kind of set up to be that option for you. We talk Madden there 24-7. It's always uh, always communicating, always networking in that. So um, you can join that for free as well. That link is in the description. And then last but not least, guys, remember, we will be live tonight at 10 o'clock p.m. Eastern time. So I'd love for you to come hang out with us there. And if you would like to pick up a personal coaching session, um, I'd highly encourage you to do that as well. I have 30 minute and 60 minute sessions available. Those have been amazingly helpful to people. So if you haven't signed up for a private session yet and you are struggling in Madden, I would highly encourage you to do that. I personally guarantee you that we can really transform your game within an hour um, of coaching guaranteed. So thanks for your time, guys. I really Really appreciate it uh, and make sure to come back check out our video at 6 o'clock p.m. Eastern time and if you uh, haven't caught some of our latest tip videos they're probably on the right side of the screen right now or they're on um, the screen for you to be able to check out so thanks for your time we'll see you in our next video coming uh, in a few hours